I had a son in 2004. His birthday was uh, March 16th, and he ended up getting an infection called sepsis, and it got into his bloodstream, and he was uh, one month and 30 days old when he passed away. I had spent two and a half years getting high, staying numb, running from the depression of my son's death, and I didn't want to face reality. And it got to a point where I literally stole almost $40,000 worth of jewelry from my mom and pawned it for drug money over a course of two and a half years. Um, I had burned every bridge there was to burn, and I was alone. My breaking point in my addiction was the realization that I was pregnant with my youngest daughter, CSUN, and I could not stop using. That was my awakening moment to the fact that I was really done. I was stuck. I was addicted. I was a mess. And I knew that I just needed to get to the lighthouse. When I had come to the lighthouse, I had burned every bridge. I had lost absolutely everything. And during my stay, God pieced everything back together. I, I now have a solid relationship with my mom. Um, my sisters are my best friends who actually call me for advice. I have all of my kids back. And I have an amazing business and a wonderful husband. And I never thought I could have any of those things. As I look at my life and I see how it's been pieced back together, it gives me such passion for the Lord. There's nothing He can't fix. I just want to say a huge thank you to all the supporters of the Rescue Mission in the White House. Because to have every piece put back together in my life, to have my children, my mother and my sisters, it's just something that I can't give words to. And without your help, I wouldn't be able to have that. Thank you. But he will restore.